Hello guys, what's up? This is Dinka Chaudhary back with another video. In this video, I'm going to tell you how you can change your chat voice in PUBG Mobile to lowly version 2.0 or Korean or Japanese or whatever you want. So I'll be giving you link of three, four files and you don't have to download any other app to do this process and you can easily change your voice in PUBG Mobile app and you can easily amaze your friends. So let's get started. So first of all, I will show you how it is looking currently, like how it works currently. It is in English currently and how does it sound? Let's see how it sounds right now. Bring up voice chat. I got supplies. Okay, so it looks like this right now. So now let's start our simple process to change the chat language or chat voice. So what you have to do is you have to go to the link in the description. After that, you have to download any file you want. In this, I'm going to change it to lowly version 2.0, which is liked by many people. So you have to download this file, which is active.sav file. Uh, the file is same for all the voices, only the size is different. For example, if you want the Korean version, just download the Korean version. If you want the Japanese version, just, just download the Japanese version. In this one, I'm going to do the lowly version 2.0. So what you have to do is you have to go to download section after downloading the file and after that you have to like locate that file there the active.sv file so I will show you how to do that I will search that file in my download fol downloads folder since there are a lot of file in that folder so after that just down just search for that active active.sv file after that long press on it and after that press move. Now after pressing move you have to select internal storage then you have to select android then you have to select data after that inside you have to select com.tencent.ig just click on that after that click on files just click on files after that click on ue4 game then shadow tracker again shadow tracker then click on saved then again go down and click on saved uh, which is a saved game info let's search where it is just click on save games after that press the just paste the file here now there is there is act there is currently an active.sav file here you have to replace it just click on ok after clicking on replace so you can see that active.sav file has been put there now you have to close your game and after that open it again let's do it so let's just close the game now after making all the changes you have to open the game let's do it and see if it has actually worked or not i will again go in training mode to show you if the voice chat works or not so there are a couple of changes that will take place after you open the game again for example your layout will be changed your graphic settings will be changed so you have to fix that as well i will show you in this video only how to fix that so let's open the training mode so let's do it so as soon as you go into training mode or a match you will notice the changes like right away because the changes are actually very noticeable so let's do it so I'm waiting for the training mode to start right now. I'll just edit it out. So that's how the training mode started. It is only a problem of one to two seconds. After that, it will be fixed. Okay, so now now the training mode has started. As you can see that the that the FPS has dropped down and there there are slight problems with the graphics. So let's go to graphic settings. After that, just choose the graphic settings whichever you had. Like I had smooth plus extreme, so now I have done it. Now after that, go to your layout, then customize. After that, choose any other layout that you want. After that, go back to your layout, and your layout will come back. So you can see how to fix your layout. Just go back to another layout, like go to layout one or layout three. After that, select your uh, layout which was previously chosen, and all your settings will be back. So that's how it goes. Now let's check the voice how it how it works. So that's how it works if you want to change your voice to other languages like Korean, Japanese or some other languages. Files are given below. You have to follow the same procedure. Just download the file. After that, replace the file in that folder that I showed you and you will you will you will have your voice changed so guys thank you for watching the video i hope you liked the video click the like and subscribe button if you found this video helpful and share for more videos like this